Hi everyone, it's Andrew Wine here from Freestyle Feet. I'm a foot and ankle physio, and a question we get emailed on a regular basis and asked to uh, cover off on is, how do I fix my flat feet? Um, it's quite a complex uh, question, so if you stick with me through some of the um, anatomy parts here, I'll try and explain it as best I can, and also explain what you can do yourself at home to solve uh, your flat feet. First of all, it's important to understand what creates our arches. And this is a function of multiple things. First and foremost, it's our bone structure. So if we look at our foot model here, how our bones all fit together in our foot is quite extraordinary and that creates a natural arch. All of us are different. We have, some have high arches, some have medium arches, some have low arches, some of us have no arches. The actual height of the arch is not a huge concern to us, um, but if we keep going and bear with me here, I'll explain how it's relevant later. So we first of all have our bone structure that creates the arch. The next thing that supports the arch are our ligaments. Our ligaments join our bones together and we have ligaments at each of these little joints that we can see here all the way through the whole foot. So those are passive structures. They are static, they help um, support that arch and keep the foot in a position to be able to push off as a rigid lever, but also cleverly, they can all the, the, the joints and the design of the foot also allows it to relax and accommodate to various surfaces. Now the third aspect of our arches are our muscular system. So our muscles, and that includes our fascia, our connective system, um, that joins everything together, they are our active system. We obviously can control our muscles, we can change the tension on our muscles, and that has a great influence on our arch as well. So it's important to think of those three things and what of those are modifiable. Our bones themselves, of course, are not modifiable. They are what we are born with. Our ligaments, somewhat modifiable. If we have had trauma to them, then they can tear and become weakened. And then in particular, there's a lot of research that shows the arch height and whether the arch is likely to collapse or not is related to something called the spring ligament. That's a small ligament in here that if you have a sprain to, it can greatly influence whether your arch is gonna drop or not. But if you have had an accident, then again, there's not much you can do about that after the fact. What you can do something about is your muscular system. So the third aspect of your arch is your muscular system that we already covered off on. And in one of my other videos, I'll show you how to strengthen all the muscles that relate to the arch. And that is something you can do something about. So think about bones, think about ligaments, think about muscles, and how we can influence those will greatly determine whether your arch rolls in a lot, whether it rolls in a little bit, and ultimately whether it collapses. So there you have it. Now you understand the fundamentals of what makes up our arch. And if you've got any questions about that or any comments, pop them in the uh, comment section below. Make sure you subscribe if you haven't done it already and also like this video and share it if you can because I'll be answering all the questions that you have around your foot function and really importantly what you can do to change some of these things yourself at home in other videos.